After years of drought, many residents across the state are dealing with mandatory water restrictions. One idea that is catching steam in San Diego is the tiered water rate structure where you pay more to use more. But does that mean that if you have the means, you can use as much water as you like? And is that fair when there is less water to go around? KPBS reporter Sharon Heilbrunn brings us a closer look at how communities are dealing with less water. Shannon Weston and her two daughters pretty much live in the pool all summer. Because we don't have air conditioning and on days like this when it's 95 degrees and it's, it's sweltering outside, it just cools you to the core. And Like many of her neighbors, Weston is making water sacrifices where she can, not just to conserve, but to keep her water bill reasonable. We get the bill every two months. So, uh, 120 every two months. Soon, she could be tempted to reduce even more. As cities across California experience severe water cutbacks, many are moving toward a tiered water rate structure, which uses money as an incentive to use less H2O. It's a method that has even caught the San Diego City Council's attention. With this approach, each household is allotted a certain amount of water, depending on how many residents live there and the property's landscaping needs. If you use more than you're budgeted, you'll feel it in your pocketbook. Use less and you'll be able to save some cash. It means you can overwater that lush green lawn, but you're going to pay for it. A lot. For Weston, tiered water rates would be a step in the right direction. I actually think that that could probably benefit us because we're a family of four, we have a pool, we have a lot of yard, but we're really good at conserving water. So I, I think that would benefit us because we would probably use less than what they, what they, what tier they put us in. The Irvine Ranch Water District in Orange County adopted this method in the early 1990s to great success. Average landscape water use is down by more than 60 percent. And according to a Voice of San Diego story, customers in Irvine Ranch pay 940 percent more for wasteful use than the lowest users pay. Currently, San Diegans pay only 22 percent more. With water rates expected to increase in the next few years, this could be what cities need to finally get residents to cut back on water usage. We asked you, should everyone be expected to conserve water even if they can pay for as much as they want? I think everyone should conserve water because there's not enough of it and we need to conserve it. We're all in this together. I mean, um, no one person uh, really needs uh, to conserve less than the other. I'm sorry. I, I don't care how much money you have. You shouldn't be able to get as much water as you want. Now, this method of using tiered water rates is just one option the San Diego City Council is considering. We want to know how you would handle our water situation. Log on to kpbs.org slash sdweek and leave us a comment. For kpbs.org, I'm Sharon Heilbrunn.